Heads up, kings and queens. I want to talk to you about becoming. Becoming uh, is way more important than your job. So I want to talk to you about the job that you're doing, the profession that you chose, because whether you like it or not, you spend a long time, majority of your awaken time, when you're awake, uh, you spend that time, those hours at what you do to get money. That's with majority of people. So I want to talk to you about what that job is making you become. Evidently, everybody has to work for their money, you know, that's some type of service that you need to provide to people. But a lot of people, you know, that I know of, including myself for a very long time, just went uh, from job after job after job after job just to be able to get money to pay for things, not even even luxurious things, but basic things like, you know, rent and electricity and food. It's all well and good with that, not a problem, but in the meantime, what you're becoming in that job should be uh, more important, should be of your primary concern rather than the money that you're making. I have this philosophy about life that we are only here for a very short period of time and this life is very transient, yes? so. Don't really know where we came from. Still debates about that. Don't even know what we came here to do. And we don't even know where we're going. <laughs> that just sums it up in a nutshell, right? So I think, you know, um, if you start prioritizing earning a living over, um, you know, the person that you're truly becoming, this development of a human being, right? Whatever this human being is, this development of you when you start from school and then you get a job just to make some money rather than if you went after a true passion. And rightfully so, you might not even end up, you know, succeeding in that passion or you very quickly find out that you don't have what it takes to, to you know, survive um, doing that job. But it's much still much better than just to making and earning a living. And more often than not, those positions, those professions or those jobs that you picked just because you wanted to make a living, more often than not, and not always, but usually they are the ones that give you anxiety. They're the ones that give you um, a lot of, when you're very tired, you work really long hours in them and they don't really give you the satisfaction that you're really after. They won't give you the growth as a result, right? So... And you wonder why people tend to tend to drugs or alcohol or um, other things, you know, or sex, or they just want to kill their time when they're when they because they're not happy, they're not fulfilled, right? When you actually do a job and you extreme, you feel extremely tired afterwards, right? Unless it's like physical, but you enjoy it. If you enjoy it, that actually is like a fertilizer to your growth, physically, mentally, spiritually, psychologically. You know, you, if you are a person like I was, you know, for a very long time, if you went from job to job to job just to make a living and you found yourself being, you know, stuck in a cubicle with, I don't know, 100 people in that office, very crammed, like, you know, if you have like partition walls around you or you're stuck in a, in a dungeon and you're just doing paperwork for a living, um, that's just, that's not natural. I don't know really for sure, but I don't believe that that's what the purpose of the evolution was, you know, for, for whatever reason, whoever created this or if it was, you know, um, based on probability and it came to, to being whoever we are, whatever we are. It just doesn't feel right. And I feel like when it doesn't feel right, there's got to be something inherently wrong with it. So... Um, my suggestion, and I'm not telling you guys to go quit your job, you know, if it's paying your bills and it's paying your um, mortgage and your, you have a family to feed. God, I, especially with this type of, you know, economical climate in many, many countries at the moment because of COVID and all of that stuff. Not saying any of that. All I'm suggesting to you is to consider what your job is making you become. 
versus what you could become and then earn a living through that, right? How you could develop yourself um, psychologically, how could you develop and mature yourself mentally, physically to a point that you are truly enjoying what you're doing, it gives you the satisfaction, it gives you the significance, all those six human needs that you um, need, uh, depending which one you choose uh, and run with as your primary um, need, it will de determine your destination, it will determine the map that you're going to navigate through this very short, transient, God knows where it came from, Who nobody really knows. Um, you know, we, we just know as much as each other, pretty much. And um, you will have a more fulfilled, transient, very short period. This is it. So I guess I will see you guys later. Adios. Even though I'm not a Spanish. <laughs> Adios.